turning down was never a problem after yeah. I was able to start running. But previously, for years, doctors were telling me every time I got Pardon injured, me. What do you expect? You know, I'm all bad for the body. The impact is bad for the body, particularly spent the morning. Your body, big fella. So you have to Weed stop. Whacking. And I did. I stopped for years. So uh, how tall are you? Six Same four. Six four. And you on the cover? Of all on those solar panels the up there. I, 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 fortunately, it's on the inside. Listen to the radio. Okay. Got a little fan over there. I, never I turn on occasionally right. just okay. to cool off. Okay, so on the inside cover, then, uh, how much did you weigh? About two hundred forty. And how much do you weigh now? But, uh, Come on, Diane. After, <laughs> after you started running. We'll do some of this with solar. I'll probably around 198, 200 now. Just a couple you. minutes. And you started running barefoot. You know, and I wish I had, but what I did was I found running teachers. I I, I spent time with about a couple of And how did you get on to them? You know, they're a fascinating culture because when the conquistadors arrived in North America, the Mayans and the Aztecs fought back, which is why they're... No mines in Aztecs rather. anymore. But that Omada disappeared out. into the labyrinthine Copper Canyon in Mexico out. and vast spider webbing network of canyons. And they have essentially been there. <laughs> they are doing now what they did in the 1600s, which is a really rare. who could train me to duplicate that. And I did. I found very good coaches. However, the flip side of that was I kept regressing back to my bad form until I finally got rid of my shoes. Christopher Mankinkola, his book is titled Born to Run. And be barefoot, when did you start? Running? Well, I probably got a lot more to do, but guy when I was young. who the hell wants to watch me fucking... Sawing wood. Let me show you around the yard a little bit. And uh, uh, all the traditional Emirates. And I did fairly well at them Should be blooming anytime level, soon. Until I got to the point where in those traditional sports, if you're not big and powerful and strong and fast, you don't make it. I got to the point where huh. I was on the court with people who were big and strong and powerful and fast. And I it's at the end of the garlic season. I got some of these up on the table, but you know what? Uh, uh, that one looks nice. Probably can't see me because the sun's behind me. My squash is really late. Basically because of the... The wet weather. I had to pull it out several times, put it in pots, and drown it. Huh. And I think I'm going to have to uh, pull out about half of this. That's way too much. Oh. Here we go. Michael likes lilies, especially Lila. Did I hate that camera, Papa? And be barefoot. He won the 1968 Boston Marathon. He has been running the Boston Marathon on every fifth year anniversary of his victory. He's finished the same Thanksgiving Day turkey trot. 47 years in a row. Turning to you, Dr. Privet, it's good to see you again. Tell me about feet and foot injuries from running. I, I look at I'm foot sweating like a pig, and pigs don't sweat, do they? My goal is to keep people moving. I believe that I'm thinking, exercise is very healthy for you. It helps put on I'm thinking that's what um, I need. Aging. 
uh, exercise, healthy diet. Y'all have a good day. Healthy body weight, not smoking and eating vegetables should keep you living a lot longer. Uh, studies